This is your seat. Wait, you ready? <laughs> yeah, let's run. Is it recording? <laughs> it's recording. Alright, so let's start. Alright, so. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> the first muscle at the very anterior portion of the shark is the first levator. Alright? The one directly behind it, right here, you can see the separation. This is the spiracular. This muscle here that looks like a cheek is the mandibular adductor. Together, the spiracular and the mandibular adductor create the first dorsal constrictors. Right after, so here's the line, right after is the second uh, dorsal constrictor and it goes all the way from here, I'm gonna trace it, here all the way to the first gill, right there. All right, so this is all portion of the second dorsal constrictor. Three through six then are going to encompass the rest of these gill arches. So one, two, three, four. That's three through six. These are the third through six dorsal constrictors. Okay? So those are all your constrictor muscles for your dorsal side. Now, again, we'll go back, show you guys again the first levator, which is right here. We can't see the second levator, so don't worry about a second levator. But you do have the third through sixth levator, also known as the cucularis. I'm sorry, it's right here. And it looks like a triangle. Okay? Now, the cucularis is homologous to? Trapezius. Good. Okay. Mm -hmm. This muscle right here, connected to the fin, is the pectoral levator, because it's going to elevate the fin, right? That's the dorsal side of the shark. All right. The first muscle we're going to talk about is the first ventral constrictor, which goes from here, right around there, and there. So this is all the ventral first ventral constrictor. It's also known as the intermandibular. If we reflect it, all right. Let's try and get in there. Now, let's try and do this. This one going straight down the center is the coracomandibular. This one underneath it is the coracohyoid. And then right underneath the intermandibular is known as the interhyoid. All right? So if they pin it here, what do you guys say? And if they pin it there, intermandibular, intermandibular, or first ventral constrictor. <laughs> the second ventral constrictor, so I'm gonna pull out the first gill arch right here. It goes all the way from here to here. This is your second ventral constrictor, okay? And then the rest, three through six, right here. So these ones, these are three through six ventral constrictors, okay? The last one are these two little pectoral looking muscles. These are known as the common coraco arcule. Okay? And actually, the last muscle is the pectoral depressor, which goes from here all the way down. Alright? And then again, you have your linea alba. Hey. <laughs> Excellent work. Thank you. Good job, Dal. That's excellent.